Right Move is trading just shy of 10% higher today, despite reporting a 34% decline in first half revenue. Now, this decline in revenue reflects the 75% discount that Right Move offered its customers between April to June in that lockdown period. Operating profits were also down 43% at £61.7 million. Pounds. Now, since the property market has reopened, however, Right Move have said that demand has been strong. Now, this is thanks in parts to people reassessing their housing needs post lockdown and also thanks to the UK's stamp duty holiday. Halifax today also reported a mini boom in house prices, which is adding to the upbeat mood surrounding the stock. However, uncertainty in the outlook remains and Right Move didn't provide a full year guidance saying that it will also reinstate dividends when it feels prudent to do so. Looking at the chart, as I said, we can see uh, this wonderful rally here in right move, trading just shy of 10% higher. It's seen a phenomenal rally since the mid-March lows, and now it trades just 1.5% down on the year, sorry, year to date outperforming that is the uh, the broader market now we can see that it's bounced off its ascending trend line here and uh, it's also trading comfortably above its 50 100 and also now it's 200 daily moving average so today's rally has taken it above that key at 200 daily moving average level. Looking ahead, we can see that perhaps 650 is a level that it could be uh, could be targeting, and beyond that, we'll be looking for um, six, 680. And that's uh, these are levels that we've not seen since February. On the downside support, this is quite an important level of support here because we've got the 50 uh, daily moving average as well as the ascending trend line support around that seven, sorry, 570 level. Breakthrough there could see a uh, right move decline back towards 550 and then on towards the uh, 100 day moving average around the 530p level. For more trading videos, please subscribe to our YouTube channel.